Happy Christmas, everybody. It's um, it's uh, it's he, Christmas. He's still sick, by the way. I just ha- I warm myself up with a little bit of whiskey. I give me the whiskey. No, do your video, charity. Um, Merry New Year's. <laughs> um, so. Yeah. Charities. Yeah, charities. Home. Yeah. That's right. Right. So, <laughs> happy Christmas, everybody. Hi. We're uh, on the go today and we go live at five uh, despite our uh, 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 the world conspiring against us and giving yes. us Ebola and everything else. And Did I tell you as I was sick, by the way? <sighs> but I'm feeling much better now. Give us that glad bottle again. Um, we are going to go live at five. Yeah, yeah, uh, she's a fairly big enough one. Uh, just touching the 1100 mark, I think, in the end. Uh, we have a huge, as I said yesterday, we did a huge response to the charities. And uh, thank you. Bit of bus to everybody. Thank you to everybody. Uh, we had one gentleman uh, caught us totally by surprise. He neither bought nor sold with us, probably wasn't even aware of us. Seen the post uh, looking for the bottles and. Um, came in and gave us quite a few bottles and quite a few good bottles as well. So uh, I'd really like to acknowledge his uh, uh, contribution to this. Um, Marcus in has been ringleading all of this uh, in Hoopla and he has been uh, put the call out to all the brands and everything else to get these bottles and I really think it's uh, a deserved cost. Now, saying that, this month we do have a couple of other charities. There is a few other we things do, going yeah. on as well. Um, but I mean the majority of the bottles are for the Help Al- Alice Beat Cancer Fund a young girl who's had an extremely rare and aggressive form of cancer and they're raising funds for the treatment and uh, it's going according to plan I mean the money's there uh, it's now just to try and make sure that she can recover her family can be supported and exactly. let's hopefully get this uh, treatment done and we can uh, make a difference to a lady's life uh, so there is loads there, I put them all on the front page of the website um, everything for charity this month is, takes up the entire front page of the website I think there's 30 odd bottles in total um, there's a bit of everything there there's uh, some bookers some tealings some boutiques old fashioned from the Scotch Malt Whiskey Society uh, some mother up ones up here from the Scotch Malt Whiskey Society Glass Nevin uh, Red Breast, uh, Jemson have given us. That's a lovely little kit. That was the one that they done, Katie, for the launch of the. Um, oh, I know, I seen that. That's fab. For the launch of the 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 the, 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 the new uh, Jemson uh, single pot still. So that's uh, the hip flask and everything in that. Could have done with the hip flask actually. Um, there also is the one of the original. Uh, Jemson, 15 year olds. This one here, Jed. Yeah, that's Red Breast, baby. Uh, uh, sorry, what did I say? Jemson. Right, sorry. Red Breast, that wee bit of whiskey did go to my head. Uh, Red Breast, 15 year old. That's the first release of the Red Breast, 15 year old. That is for the Wexford Hospice Home Care Services. Um, that's a real good one to have. There's a Teeling 10 year old, Blanton's, um, them X4 Futures, uh, the Scotch. Uh, they're all for the Alice one. Um, here's one, Kenny. Did you see this? No. Um, flavoured with bourbon biscuits. Hardly. I don't know. Looks like oh, look. Looks like there's crumbs in the bottom. Yeah, it does look like there's crumbs in the bottom. <laughs> and infused with real life, no fooling bourbon biscuits. There's a first for me. There you go. Bourbon biscuits that are got bourbon in them. I love bourbon biscuits. You do like bourbon biscuits, so there's one for you. <laughs> um, I'll take that out of the way for the minute. There's more Scotch Malt Whiskey Society, Weller, uh, Waterford, um, Jemson 18s. There's a huge, huge, huge selection. There's a That's green bad. spot, a uh, single cask from Sergio. Uh, there's a bit of everything, and it's been phenomenal. And I'm just, thank you to everybody. Definitely. On top of those, we have, I have a big Chivas Regal over there on the ground. It's a 4.5 litre in a cradle. Uh, for those of you who want it out of the home bar, look at that. Or even if you do have a bar, that's a nice one to have. Look at that. Uh, and that is raising funds for Rio Callahan's 
um, daughter school in in Ballin the College, our, our Lady of Good Counsel. Um, those of you that know Ray will be keen to support Ray and to 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 help uh, his daughter school. Um, Definitely. So they've do great work there. And then we have uh, the Cologne um, bottle number one. So on this is bottle number one. And this is of the Capuchin Cask Programme. So this is brought by uh, Ian, John, Mary, Jennifer, whatever he calls herself. Yes. Themselves. Themselves. Uh, and the lads in the Friends of Irish Whiskey Facebook group. Um, previously, it had been the Friends of Middleton Facebook group. And they had done huge work for charity uh, and they just wanted to broaden our, the, the, the scope and not just be about Middleton yeah. uh, so he created the, the, the Friends of Irish Whiskey group himself, Eddie, Mick McGuire, a few of the lads um, look enough can't be said about the charity work that they do, genuinely oh, enough can't massive. be said but they did, raised huge amounts of money last year uh, he is Ian himself is a pain but he's brilliant, and he's brilliant at, at, at getting these things done and pushing people and getting stuff over the line. And it's it's a, a well deserved charity. Um, Capuchin Day Centre in Dublin is. Did you see the queue? Queue. I was just about to say it, Kate. Holy moly! The pressure they are under at the minute is just wrong, and I I I truly mean it is wrong. Um, don't start me ranting on it because no. I am a bit ill and I have had a wee drop of whiskey. But in the world and the society we live in, and that there's so much wealth in uh, in huge corporations, in the government, money being swirled around left, right, and centre, massive salaries being paid, and yet people are queuing for food, and that is just wrong. And I, I, I it annoys me. It really annoys me. Proper upsets me. Um, we here at Irish Whiskey Auctions, me and Katie. Uh, those of you that know our story, we've been broke. Yeah. We've there's been plenty of times in our life we were stone broke and we've were on the breadline and we had to struggle and we had friends, family, and network around us. And only for the grace of them are we here now doing yeah, what we're doing. Definitely. And it's only for the grace of uh, the Capuchin Day Centre and the help of support of Ian and all the lads at that that uh, contribute to these things. Dig deep, lads. Whatever you can do, whatever you can give. If you can only give them a five, I'll give them a five. Or whatever you can do, do it. Even, we, even if you can't bid on our auctions no. because everything's going mental, yeah. even make a private donation. Make a private donation. Nobody has to know. No. It's the best way. We have said from day one that we were going to do as much for charity as we could possibly do, and we will continue to do that, and we will for always and ever do that. Oh, God, yeah. Um, but uh, uh, this one is a, is, a, is a real big one, and as I say, I think people need to, to, to dig deep. And... Also, people need to sort of start and wake up and see, you know, what's important in life and, and stuff like that. So uh, it does get me uh, rather it does. irate. Um, but anyhow, I'll go back to me whiskey. No, bottle. you won't. You go back to me. Um, uh, with that set is the two uh, prints that go with it. Uh, and those of you that were lucky enough to, to buy the prints uh, for the, 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 the Capuchin release... We'll also notice that there are numbers on the prints match. So I don't know if you can get down into that yet. Oh, I'll come up to you. I'll come up to you, buddy. Sorry. So on the actual print itself, this is uh, bottle number one, zero, zero, one. And obviously with Orla's prints, you have a matching number down in the bottom corner uh, with uh, Orla's emboss on it and the whole lot. And then on Fran's one, which I think is gorgeous. It's it the is. first time um, Fran has been involved. A lot of you would be familiar with Orla's work. Uh, but it's the first time that Fran Levy, who himself deserves a medal for what he's done for Pachin, uh, he's also got bottle 001 out of 100 on, um, on, his on, on, on his prints as well. So that's a matching set. Bottle number one, the two prints, number one. Uh, it's in auction uh, starting today. Auction ends on Monday the third, the second of January. We obviously couldn't end it on on the Sunday night no. because that's New Year's Day, and those of you who might be having too many sherries might bid a little too much, which is not a bad thing. But there's well, also users that might be advantage. Uh, and I will be working uh, behind the bar in Gigi's as well. Yes. So do you? Yes. Um, we now start. Uh, we finished this today, and we've got a, a two week run of work now with the pub and. Yeah. Uh, a busy period. We get Christmas well. Day off. We get Christmas Day off. 
Uh, there's a lot of them out there that didn't want us to have a Christmas Day. I know, they wanted I'm us to that. open on on Christmas Day. But look, um, I think that's it. Um, I I have said my piece on on the charities. I've said my piece on the Capuchin Day Centre. In Eddie, the lads with the Friends of Irish Whiskey, Fair Juice. I mean, what they're doing at the minute with the the, the Facebook auctions uh, is raising a huge amount of money. And look, we can only hope that uh, it makes genuinely makes a difference to some people's lives because lads it, it's it's a, it's a terrible place to be it's not a nice place to be no so um not. dig deep uh, charity auctions there's plenty of everything else i mean there is we're, we're the auctions <coughs> Niall has uh, started racking the room he's nearly finished actually in fairness to him he's, he's worked trojan uh, jed uh, Sinead, robert kathy olivia even Sinead came in today. Sinead came in today and she's hanging out of herself and she's genuinely come in today as well. Um, thank you to each and every one of the team here that make uh, 2020 a great year for us, that make every auction nothing short of a miracle to get it over the line. And to you, just... 2022, baby. 2020, why was I saying? You said 2020. Ah, whatever the yeah, fucking know. hell it is. Nobody has any of these. And I'm sick. Did I tell you I'm sick? Yeah, yes. Um, We are back. Uh, if anybody wants to reach out to us over the auctions, the office will be closed. Yes. Uh, if you do phone the number, leave a message, we'll get back to you. Send an email is the quickest way and we'll respond or on our socials or anything like that. But in the meantime... Sit down, have a drink, tell the ones around you you love them, and enjoy Christmas. Really, really enjoy Christmas to each and every one of you. I really do hope they enjoy it. All right? Happy Christmas. Bye.